Hi, I'm Dr. Alvarez with endobariatric.com and welcome to another episode of our FAQ uh, section. And today I will be talking to you about fasting after your gastric sleeve. This is very common and uh, well, uh, intermittent fasting has become a, a thing recently or, or lately, uh, but it's also time for uh, uh, some uh, religion, religions to actually uh, fast for religious purposes. And I get this question quite often, can you really uh, fast uh, while uh, getting or after your gastric sleep? The answer is um, yes, but not right away. The reason being is uh, I would suggest you let your sleeve uh, go after maybe six months, let that swollen tissue, all that inflammation from the actual surgery cool down, go away, and then after six months, uh, you, could, you could fast. Now, uh, yes, you can fast as intermittent fasting or for religious purposes, but I, if you're a gastric sleeve patient, I, I, wanna, I wanna give you a, maybe a pointer here, is number one is touch base with your surgeon, uh, touch base with your, with your surgeon's team and see what they they suggest. But uh, in in our uh, in our practice, we suggest you take maybe just one dose, one dose a day, of an acid blocker or or a PPI like a meprazole, just to protect your inner layer of your stomach while you're fasting. Now, when you do intermittent fasting, I do intermittent fasting like uh, six days out of the week. I only. Uh, I don't fast on Sundays when I have breakfast with the family, but other than that, I, I fast, uh, I have dinner maybe 8, 9 p.m., kind of late, and then I go the whole night, of course, because I'm sleeping, the whole morning with nothing uh, to eat, I drink coffee, black, it has to be black or, or just plain water, throughout the morning, and uh, I eat at around 1 or 2 p.m. So I fast, I do intermittent fasting every single day except on Sundays. And I've been doing this for a couple of years now. I really like the idea of, of me being in surgery. I do surgeries every single day. And I really like the idea of uh, having all the attention, all the blood supply here and having no blood supply extra going toward the gut while I'm doing digestion. So that's why I fast while I'm, I'm in surgery, I'm all there. So uh, that's, I really love that. I like the concentration. I don't feel sluggish. I like, uh, I like the effect I feel of intermittent fasting. But can you f do intermittent fasting after sleep? Yes, you can. Again, not the first six months, not recommended because it's still very swollen. You gotta wait for that swollen tissue after your sleeve uh, to cool down. But uh, again, I would suggest you take a Meprazole or Pepsid AC or some sort of acid blocker to protect the inner layer of your stomach while you're doing fasting. Can you fast for longer periods of time? Uh, yes, again, for religious purposes mainly. Yes, you can, like Ramadan. Yes, you can. Uh, again, I would suggest you, uh, before you start that fast, you take uh, an acid blocker or a PPI just to protect that stomach, protect that sleeve, because you only get one sleeve, you only get one stomach, and you gotta take care of it, all right? So uh, if, you, if you like to more, know more about intermittent fasting or any other questions that you may have, please uh, let me know. Put it down on the comments down below. I'll be more than happy to address these. And we can even add them here to our FAQ section, all right? So. Uh, if you enjoyed the content, please leave me one of these. It's uh, of great benefit and support uh, to the channel. And don't forget to subscribe as well. That way you don't miss any of our future videos and content. All right, I'm Dr. Alvarez with endobariatric.com where we are changing lives one sleeve at a time. Take care and God bless.